Hey guys, this is Jonas here doing another uh, Star Wars The Force Awakening series, a Black Inch series. So this is Paul Dameron in his X Wing fighter suit instead of a original jacket like he's seen in the movie. Now, this is the second wave from number seven. I think it's from number six is Captain Phasma along with Zero, whatever his name, the hat and weird bug eyes Cyclops. That's what else. On the back here, it's got a little bio of him. Maria says, In the ace pilot, Paul Dameron is a leader of the resident fight against the evil force orders. He soars into the battle behind the controls of the modern X Wing fighters. If you're not who that enough familiar, if you've seen the Force of Wick or the Return of Jedi at towards the end, you could barely see his hard to see it was make a small cameo appears. There we go. Now this time here's a big screen. So yeah. So that's Paul Dermot's package. So let's take it open up. Let's take a look out of the package. Alright, we're back guys with Paul Darren outside the package. Is the is actually an disease remold from the previously uh, the X Wing fighter figures from the Black Inch series. Uh the Skywalker Figures from the X Wing Fire figures. These are remolded. So it's a really nice looking figure, really nice likeness of Oscar Isaac as Paul Darren. Now, first, let's take a look at his little surgery first. He comes with little uh, pistols. This was, I'm not sure what the laser pistol I'm not sure they're supposed to use it. I'm not sure he used it in the movie. I've seen a couple times he uses some kind of rifle thing. He looks like electromagnetic shock blast. That uh, was kind of different. He also comes with a helmet, X-wing fighter's helmet. It's a really nice, cool surgery detail. He also nice. You can fit in your helmet. It can fit nice to his face. It can fit. And there's Paul Darren and his X-wing fighters. Very cool looking details. And he also comes with two or train pairs or train hands. One is the this one without his gloves. Also, and didn't show you, he comes with a little peg to his the peg to his. Also, his wrist. You can take this. Uh, little, take this. Take this hand off. And replace to his scalp. There's a nice little cool options. This. Well, let's take a look at what his helmet. Let's look at the head scope, the features head scope. It's pretty good likeness, how he looks like, uh, likeness of Oscar Isaac as. Paul Darren, like this new jumpsuit space jumpsuit outfit. There's a nice looking detail sculpted. It's got a Rebels on the logo. As for size comparison figures, here is next to fan figures. Now, if you're not not familiar with this, he appears in a film where. Paul Dameron, try, when the fans rescue Paul as his stormtroopers disguise, or is he trying to escape in this film? We'll, we'll show about the TIE Fire, the big one we'll do later. That's a very exciting, I can't wait to get to see TIE Fire. As a question for him, he has a ball joint head, it goes up and down, his arm goes up and down, goes in and out, elbow grease, he does ball joint wrists. It does cool looking bouldering waist can moving up and down. Can't left right because hit it by tubes. And his leg is forced and back. It goes in and out. It can't go can't go in and out because hit it by uh, some kind of space tube. He does double hinge elbows, hinge knees, and his ankle pad side to side. And his ankle pad rocking side to side. Also I didn't show you he has swivel hips that's pretty much the question so yeah
the peg of his hand. Overall, very nice figure. Very glad to have one. Like I said, this is a second wave. I was I trying to get the Captain Phasma. He's a cool looking character. Cause I can't find him. So, what do you guys think about this comment below? So, hopefully you subscribe to this video. Hopefully you're doing this. So, thanks for watching and bye.